Today we're going to find the most legendary of frogs, and that all starts with this one. Let's set him loose on the world, there's no turning back now, our very first frog. Now what we do with the frogs is feed them lots of flies, so we're basically sacrificing all of these creatures, so we'll make sure he's a well-fed frog. And quite quickly we unlock the new one, a green tree frog, Common. But that's okay because he's now fully grown and fully grown frogs generate money over time. Alternatively, we can sell him for $17.25. And that's pretty good considering he's a frog. I'd probably sell my children for less than that. Actually, no. I would definitely sell my children for less than that. The next frog's gonna cost $10, so we're gonna have to sit here and wait for him to eat some flies. And he's conveniently relocating himself everywhere, probably in search of more food, but he wants some flies, we'll give him some flies. He's also making money for eating the flies, so the more these are in his face, the more money we're gonna make. It's a pretty slow process otherwise. Five cents per fly. It is tempting to sell him right away and buy several new frogs, but if he's here, we get 8% increased frog quality. And this guy's got uncommon quality, so we'll maybe get some better quality frogs we can sell for more so we need a stockpile of frogs that's all i'm hearing and there's a ten dollars we need to buy our next frog one secret swamp frog and the big reveal what do we get i think it's exactly the same frog it's actually unknown we actually might have to make it grow up but he's working his way there we just got to feed him enough flies but our income has effectively doubled now that we have a second moron so it's a slim green tree frog which is actually a different variety than our first one they're both worth $17.25 to sell they make six cents per second this one has 200% more fly burps I don't know what those are and if we don't know what something is we sell it immediately for profit and then we can buy two more frogs for hopefully better quality results that one definitely looks different that's got to be something good I'm just going to keep force feeding these things until we get something amazing. I don't care how long it takes. It's a brown rain frog. This one actually has an amazing quality plus 7 cents fly value. So that took it flies from 5 to 12 cents. That's actually pretty big. And because of our three frogs and newfound income with that, we don't have to sell any frogs to earn the $10 we need to get another frog. Suddenly I'm feeling very rich. I don't know how many frogs we can fit in here, but we're just going to keep forcing them in. We start selling the weakest link after a while. Maybe I can get lucky and just find frogs that increase the fly value. Like every single frog will increase value. That will make a fortune off every single fly. We found our first uncommon, Angry Eyed Tree Frog. That's a very descriptive name. We get 6% increased frog rarity, which is actually really nice, and 10 cents per minute, so he's actually considerably better. He's worth a lot to sell as well, but we're going to keep him because that rarity is huge. And by the time they finished eating all their flies, we already have enough to buy a new frog. So the income is starting to roll in the background quite quickly. As long as we keep the flies going. Too many frogs in the tank. All right, plus one maximum frogs. And our new frog. Look at that thing. Oh, maybe it's the same as the frog behind it. They all look weird when they're small. I definitely feel like this one down here has a yellow tongue. And I feel like that's unique as to the frogs we've seen so far. So I need him to grow up quickly so we can investigate him further. So that is a striped pink tree frog. That increases fly value by 11 cents. It's got uncommon, uncommon. Now nah, we're making some money. We need to cram more frogs in here. One maximum frog. We can actually afford that twice right away because we're making so much money. Now we can get two more idiots in here before you know it. There's one. When we discover five more frogs, we get a new set as well. So we'll drop the first one in so he can start growing and then before you know we'll have enough for the second one that was way quicker than i thought a purple one that's got to be even better that's got to be epic or rare or something that's got to be a good one i like how these idiots are so smart that if you put the flies out of their reach they'll literally just reach your tongue for them and not get them we've got 40 dollars now so we're gonna open up space for more frogs and speaking of which we're gonna buy another frog as well hopefully it's a purple background it's a common and our rare frog is a red spotted big smiley frog. I feel like they make up the names at this point. So that's rare and common. They actually make 50 cents per minute. They're worth 60 to sell. 100% more fly burps isn't great. Also, this frog is very common. 5% increased frog quality. I don't love that, but I think we still got room for more frogs, so we won't uh, be too hard on it yet. What we will do is hatch two more frogs of blue quality. And this is the rare one over here, the enormous one. Not sure what it's doing, but we'll just leave it to eat a lot of flies. We're going to make a lot of money per second now. So the two new frogs are both uncommon. This one adds $12.82 to the golden fly value. I don't know if we've seen the golden fly, but that's interesting and an increase to frog quality. So basically, the more frogs, the better everything's going to be. So we need to make some more room. $22 for an upgrade, $30 for an upgrade, but that allows us to buy about two more frogs still with our leftover money. As soon as you put some flies down for them to eat. We got one we recognize and one we don't. That's okay. More frogs, more value. Then we'll start to wean out the weak ones. We're only left with the valuables. So there is a tier beyond rare that we haven't seen yet. This orangey pink thing. And then once we unlock the new frogs, there's a whole other set we got to go through as well. So these two new frogs, I actually don't like either of them. I'm just straight up going to sell them. They don't increase fly value. And at this point, we need performers. But while we're at it, we're going to buy space for another frog. And then we're going to buy a third one that we could drop three new ones in. One, two, three. And as long as you're dumping lots of flies in their tank, we're making lots and lots of money. 
uh, the green one already hatched, uh, grew up. It gives 88% more cell value, so obviously we're just going to sell it. It basically has its own ability to sell itself. But that's okay, because right away we're going to replace it with something newer and hopefully better. A blue frog. And I guess if we have $100, we might as well spend that on buying another frog, which is hopefully again something amazing. Well, we'll take it. And a new frog has been found. Our brown bullfrog finally grew up, and there's, I think, going to be two of those. So we'll take a look at our new money bags. That would be this one with a rare quality. 14% increased frog quality, which is pretty good. Golden fly value I don't love, so we'll maybe just go ahead and sell this one. The increase to frog quality is good, though, because we can just start stacking those stats until we get better quality, and hopefully we can get higher money per fly. He even sparkles because he's got such good quality. I always wanted a sparkly frog. And you know if something's sparkling, it's got to be good. We need more room, $70 for an upgrade. We're going to buy as many frogs as we can fit in here. We're just going to force them on in. I can take pride in the fact that I'm probably one of the few hundred airs off of frogs. So we did get an increase to fly value off this one. This one adds 33% money per minute. So I assume that it's per minute here. I don't know if that's in total. I'm going to assume it's not, so we're going to sell that one, and we're also going to sell the golden fly value. Then it's $100 to make more room in the tank, but then it's only a few dollars to buy more frogs, and rinse, repeat. Ooh, we got another bullfrog, hopefully a sparkly one, and we got a new blue quality one too. That's definitely important. We're currently getting 31 cents per fly, and we've got a lot of flies in the tank. I realize I can just spawn the flies in one place, and the frogs can eat them as fast as I can spawn them anyway, so I don't need to distribute them. If the frogs want to get fed, they've got to earn it. They've got to hop their way all the way over to the cluster. The new frog we found, Uncommon Mad Green Rain Frog, which so far gives 200% more fly burps. No good, we're gonna sell that. This one's got a rare quality, it's a common frog though, plus $18 golden fly value, no. Our other brown bullfrog did grow up though, 10% fly value, so our fly value's gone up even more. So we're gonna increase our maximum frogs and buy as many of these as we can. And we got three cards to throw down, none of them are legendary. But we're up to 41 cents per fly at this point, so that feels pretty good. The new frogs that hatched, this one has an uncommon sell value, so we get $33 for him. This one's got 65% more cell value. Who's going to go? Increase frog rarity. We'll keep this one for now because as we hatch new frogs, hopefully we get some legendaries. We made room for more frogs. We can still fit a lot more in here. We've only got to discover one more new kind to unlock the new pack. So there's a blue, a purple, and a green. The frogs are a little bit clustered up, so I'm just going to force the flies directly into them. So these new ones so far increase frog quality. They're not going to keep that. This one's got plus 32% money per minute. I think that only considers itself, so we'll wait for the purple one to grow up, and we're going to buy more regular frogs in the meantime. One of these new ones is simply common common. Nothing good there. It's got to go. We'll wait for this one. 9% increased frog rarity. We will keep. They eat the flies so quick, I can't actually keep up. Our frog size is getting bigger, and we're going to have a few more to throw into the tank. Blue, green. So currently we can fit 19 frogs, our money per minute I guess in the background is $2.43. Our new purple frog gets 31% per minute, we're going to sell that because that's useless, $60. 100% more fly burps also going to go, plus 2 fly XP for frogs is actually quite nice. Because they had a base of 5 XP, so 7 XP is actually a considerable upgrade. And I think we got another epic frog if I'm seeing that correctly. Up top we got another one of these big morons, perfect. Eat your flies and grow up. Okay, one of the new frogs has increased our frog quality, so he's gonna go. We need to start saving up for the good, good frogs. Our tank is once again getting bigger. For $10, we're gonna buy a new frog. We can't actually afford a new one. We need more flies. Uh, for now, we're gonna drop a new blue one in, which is a good start. Our new purple smiley more on its way $69 to sell. It's money per minute doesn't interest me. Frog quality does, and we're still waiting for this one to grow up. He's almost there, but we gotta throw a new few, for, uh, few new frogs in the tank while we wait. That's a legendary. I can already see it up top. It's the moment we've all been waiting for. Look at him in all his glory. I bet he's going to take a long time to grow up, so hopefully he hangs out up here where he can have his monopoly on flies. At this point, he's my favorite. None of the other frogs matter. They can all die for all I care. We gotta get the legendary going. He was smart enough to leave his uh, abundance of food. He jumped to the bottom where there were no flies, so he's maybe not the brightest. But he's already halfway to grown up. 600 experience. That's a lot. And there it is. Purple-eyed dart frog. Epic. Okay, so not legendary, but it is epic. So he makes a dollar per minute. He's got a common quality and 150% burped fly value, which is really epic. So we're going to go ahead and sell them, and then we're going to take a look uh, at all of our old frogs to make sure there's nothing sitting there that we don't want anymore. Golden fly value, where did, why did we keep this thing? Mm, there's a few frogs we should have sold. I lost track of some of these. I either want fly value or increased quality or rarity. Anything else has got to go, or an experience. So we can increase uh, that for $450, but we could buy frogs. $500? I probably shouldn't have spent all that money. All right, we got to feed some frogs. Eat, my beautiful morons. Eat. 
we need to replace you all with better frogs. Luckily I can set up my auto clicker to also right click and that actually spawns flies a lot faster. So I can just go like this and we can expedite our process greatly. We're making a little little cluster organism of flies that are going to get eradicated quickly. We could probably actually drown the frogs in this many. We can't even see the frog anymore. It's just made of flies at this point. 4,000 milligrams of caffeine later and I'm feeling pretty good about our $1,500. So we could buy one, two three of Riverbank Riches frogs. And these are obviously going to be big earners and new frogs. We already got a blue and a big blue. They take a lot of experience. Our legendary from the last one took 600. These are 1200. The experience does tick up automatically though, which is nice. But we're also going to force feed the life out of them. If they're not overdosing on flies on any given minute, they're not eating enough. I've spent another $500 on another frog. This one's going to be of green quality, but still quite valuable, I'm sure. And our first of the new set is grown up. Look at those eyes. He can see right into the future. Blue belly, big eye, dart frog. So he adds 9 cents to fly value, which is great. And he's $1.15 per minute, $110 to sell, which means these other ones are going to be much better. Plus, we're now making an even 50 cents per fly. And at the rate we're spawning flies, we're actually getting pretty rich off this endeavor. Progress has slowed down a little bit, even at the rate of frogs, but we did get this new one. Uh, it's an uncommon version. Oh, and this other big boy, uncommon as well. These beautiful morons are worth almost $3 per minute in the background, uh, but I don't like their other things, even though they're uncommon, uncommon. Uh, we don't really care about those stats, so they're actually just going to get sold right away. Luckily, they could be replaced right away, at least one of them. The other one's going to take a second. That's common value, but that could still be very good. And you'd think with all the upgrades, we have the extra frog quality and rarity, we'd be finding a lot more than we are. But we still find a lot of commons, sadly. Whatever the case, we could buy a new one of those, and it's another green quality. I decided to save up a little bit. We have twelve and a half thousand dollars and some new frogs. So we have some ones that increase our fly value. Five cents isn't much, but I'll take it. Fly burps and frog quality. That can say fly burps gotta go. Now using all of our money, we can increase our tank size several times, and we're going to be keeping an eye on how much money we have left because these get expensive quickly. And at five hundred dollars per frog, we need to be careful to balance things out. But that's a lot of new frogs, some of which are purple. So while I'm at it, I'm gonna buy another uh, space for the frogs because we almost have the five hundred dollars we need for a new one. There is blue, blue purple, purple, green, 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 blue, purple, blue, green, blue, green, blue, purple. So the rarity is starting to pay off, and uh, those purple ones will hopefully have really good skills attached to them, so we can make even more money. But we're up to fifty-five cents per fly at this point, and we already have the five hundred dollars we need, so we're gonna buy one more five hundred dollar frog. A few quick minutes and six thousand dollars later, we've got some new frogs, including the rare horn-spotted tree frog, which is probably my new favorite. Oh, this one's sparkly, so it's gotta be good. So my new favorite is quickly become my new least favorite. Plus thirty-four percent money per minute. Don't care. It's gonna go immediately. Seventy-nine percent more sell value. It can go. We're not getting good luck with these ones. They're making some decent money, but gold and fly value don't care more fly burps also don't care this is the one with the rare quality 34 percent money per minute so it's two dollars per minute but we make way more money than that if we're using an auto clicker so the only one we're going to keep in that bunch is increased frog quality even this one golden fly value rare frog gone so let's roll the dice and some more 500 dollars frogs now we have 4500 dollars left over so we can increase our maximum size and buy another 500 dollars frog and the cycle repeats we did get one purple out of that bunch. And it's a purple we haven't seen before, but I'm assuming that is still indeed a frog. And then we just cluster bond the frogs with flies one more time and then we'll see what we got. Another $5,000 later and we have a black eyed happy glass frog. And with him we get an 8% increase to frog quality, so he boosted himself up to uncommon presumably. This one gets plus one fly XP for frogs, which is huge. More cell value means he's going to be sold immediately. Golden fly value is garbage. We do have an extra frog rarity, so we're getting lots of useful frogs. There's only two more useless ones to sell. And our fly XP is up to eight, so that's well over 50% from its original value. Time to buy some more frogs. Hopefully we get, well, we got one purple, one blue, so the quality is going up. I'm going to sell these old frogs. This one has 5% fly value. That's not enough to justify the space anymore. Same with this one for nine cents, because they'll be replaced with higher level frogs that hopefully have better stats than that. Then we sit there and force feed them until they explode. Some of our new frogs are showing up quickly. We're getting a lot of percent per minutes, which are going to be sold immediately because I don't want percent per minute. I want results. Still going to be a minute for the horn spotted tree frog, given that it's got a long ways to go. Luckily, in the meantime, we can buy more frogs, of which we got four greens and one purple. I feel like we're getting really bad luck for some of these. We're mostly getting more cell value, which I don't really love right now. We do have one of our purple frogs about to grow up though too, so we'll see what that turns into because that's got a big potential. 113% burped fly value. Gone. Okay, we'll in with some new frogs then. That was several thousand dollars in frogs. We did get a purple and a blue. 
we have not got the epic yet. So for our new frog so far, we have burp value, that's gonna go. More cell value, that's obviously gonna go. Then we've got fly value, which isn't very strong, so it's gonna go. Fly burps, definitely gonna go. And purple one, that's not quite there yet. And despite all of our rarity boosts, we got four basic frogs in a row. So I'm also gonna take a minute to remove some of the older frogs that if they're a common quality old frog with a bad stat, they're gonna go. 5% increased frog quality, not good enough for us anymore. You gotta be much better. So after selling a few basic morons, that's made room for some new frogs that are definitely going to grow up but we got an epic out of that finally so that's going to be new and hopefully amazing so now it's just a matter of force feeding enough flies for it to grow up the rest of the frogs are getting close we got increased rarity burp value can just always go 50 percent more cell value you're gone 33 percent money per minute we don't need that anymore we're already filthy rich it's a shame this is rare and uncommon but it landed on burp value so it's gonna go our great hope is in the epic frog wearing sunglasses and it's ticking along it's very close now so we'll throw a bunch of flies down and smother the frog and it already hatched spotted spectacles rain frog the only animal in the animal kingdom known to wear sunglasses it's not sparkling so it's not amazing quality but it is still epic to be fair it is uncommon quality 8% increased frog rarity so using that we can find more epics and it's worth $1,518 to sell. So at this point, we would buy more space for frogs and more frogs and continue the process. But we found our epic frog for now, so we're gonna let these idiots sit here and gorge on fries for the next thousand years.